How's it going everyone and welcome to the video. Today I wanted to talk to you guys about a little razor I've been using recently and my decision to try my very best to switching to double edge safety razoring my head. That's right, today we're gonna look at the Wilkinson Sword Classic. I think this is a highly underrated little gem of a razor. Pick this up for four pounds in boots in the UK, right? For only four pounds. Of course, it is made of plastic, but hey, it comes with five blades to get you started, and that's perfect. I think it's perfect for anyone who wants to try to make that switch from using a cartridge razor and using a double-edged safety razor for shaving their head. You know, we've been doing this for a long time now, guys. We've been looking at a lot of different products and people keep saying to me, yo, you need to get on that double-edged safety razor hype. We'll call it DE safety from now on. So I have tried in the past to use the DE razor and I failed, I failed miserably. A few mistakes I made, one, didn't have a clue what I was doing. I watched a few videos on YouTube but I had no idea what I was doing. And number two, I didn't have any proper blades. I went down to the local shop. Yeah, boy, um, that one, They miraculously had some, threw them in there, they were blunt as anything, and it was just all wrong. At a second attempt, and it was an improvement because some people commented on my video like, dude, what are you doing? That technique is ridiculous. So I went back and there was improvements, but it was nowhere near the shave I got with a cartridge razor. So we've tried a load of those, but I've always had this thought in my mind, like, come on, I need to get this double-edged safety razor in my head down. I've got to get the technique down because I just think for longevity, it's the way to go. It's like, it's really the next level up. We start with that buzz cut and we progress, we progress, we have fun with it, we use new products and I just, again, I feel like the double-edged safety razor is the pinnacle there. So like I said, this razor comes with some blades to get you started, but maybe you wanna try looking into some slightly better blades. I'm using the Astra Platinums here and I literally went on Amazon, these had great reviews, so did um, some razor blades from Derby. I just picked these up and they are so, so sharp. I was really shocked at how sharp they are. Such an improvement on the first blades I used. So these blades, I really recommend them. The razor itself is really easy to use. It's a two-piece razor. You literally just twist the handle, the top will come off, little plastic thread there, so you do need to be careful, but it's, it seems really sturdy. You put the new blade on there, twist it up, and it's literally as simple as that. You are good to go. So I think if you looked after this razor, any double edge safety razor to, for that matter, it could honestly last you a lifetime of shaving. And of course, the good thing about the double edge safety is it cuts down on waste. And I'm no Greenpeace activist, but I really think that's a good thing to do. Cut down on that plastic, cut down on that waste, and of course, swapping out those cartridges all the time, you know, it does create a lot of waste, not to mention the cost. So I use this razor like I use any other razor. I jump in the shower there and I warm that head up, really get everything nice and warm. One thing I do differently is I don't use my normal shaving cream. I found that I needed something a lot more slick, and I've actually been using the shave butter from Omni Shaver. I put loads of it on mix it with quite a lot of water and I just think because you don't have those strips on the double edge safety razor like we do with the normal cartridge razor right we have those lubricating strips and I think that honestly makes a big difference so you do need to use a shaving cream that's going to be really nice and slippery slidey and so I found this shave butter to be perfect for that and when I'm doing the head shave I will keep applying some more and keep applying lots of water to keep it nice and slick so when I get started I first start off in the middle of my head like I do with any head shave that's the part where there's the least amount of hair and I can get it done pretty quickly. I don't mess about going with the grain here. I go pretty much straight against the grain and it's it's an, it's a breeze. It shaves off no problem at all because there's not really that much hair there. Go against the grain and yeah, I get a lovely beautiful head shave that way. On the sides, I go sort of across the grain. I use really the same shaving pattern I would with a normal cartridge razor, but you see there with the technique, I use sort of short strokes when I'm using the double safety razor and I'm really trying hard 
not to press down, okay? I use the weight of the razor, I hold it at the bottom there so I can kind of get a better feel for it. I can keep the angle of the razor blade nice. And yeah, I just cut away a little bit by bit, take my time with it. Like I said, it's a bit of an art form, this double-edged safety razor shaving. You've got to get that technique down. And I just sort of slowly work my way across the head and I get a great smooth head shave with it. It's baby butt smooth at the end of it. So I go against in this sort of sparse area. Then at the sides, I go across the grain first of all. At the back, I do actually give it one go over just with the grain, just to try and get things a little bit more comfortable. And then again, I go with for a short strokes, but for one strip all the way up the back of the head there. And I go against the grain and it does a really good job. I tidy up the sides there, going against the grain, hold those ears back. And at the end there, just tidy bits up and make sure I haven't missed any stray hairs. So it's an interesting one. Listen, I haven't made the full switch. I haven't thrown away my other cartridge razors because sometimes if I don't want to take my time with it, if I just want to get it done and I want the least amount of irritation, for me, I found that the cartridge razor really is the best for that. And I'm using it at the moment, Dorco Pace 6 Plus. I just find I get a fantastic head shape with this thing. I get no irritation. I can shave my head really fast in the shower. We're talking one, two minutes max, never cut myself. I really can't fault it. But there's always been this thing in my back of my mind that's saying, hey, make the switch to double edge safety razor shaving. So I'm trying my very best. And this was the, only the second double edge safety razor I picked up. I did a little poll over on the communities tab and on Instagram asking, hey, do you want to see some shaves with some vintage razors. You guys voted yes, so I had a little eBay spree. So we're gonna throw some of those videos into the mix. I think that's gonna be really interesting, using some vintage razors to go with some head shaving. Really, that's just for fun, just for interest, so I'm looking forward to bringing you those ones. I'm gonna do a separate video talking about my three top tips for using a double-edged safety razor. Some things that really, really helped me so much. I haven't made the full switch because I do get some very, very slow slight irritation steel. It's very slight, it's just at the back here and at the sides, it could be that I'm being too aggressive still, but I need the smoothest shave possible. I'm gonna persist with the double-edged safety razor, guys, so I'm gonna keep you updated. As always, I wanna thank you for watching this one. Just a little update, little interesting product to share with you guys. It's only four pounds, guys. So if you wanna try it out, try it. Let me know how you get on with that one. If there's any double-edged safety razor experts out there, jump in the comment section to give us some tips. I hope you enjoyed this video. I wanna thank you for watching, guys, and I will see you very soon for that next video. Make sure you're subscribed if you haven't yet to see those tips coming soon. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. I swear I like your style. Put you in Chanel cause it's just perfect for your smile. Girl, I swear for you I run the world, I run the mile. The way you look at me, I think I'm going insane. It's crazy how we started now to what the love you can. You need me say my name. Don't ever hesitate. It's 2 a.m. outside.